Today I would like to talk about one issue which I faced, uh, which is talking to camera in front of other people. But first of all, we need to get some food for Agla because she will be very angry. Angry, yeah, if she will not get some food. So heading to get some oysters. <laughs> Let me tell you a couple of things which I prefer to do when I'm filming myself, how I started to do that and maybe they will help you as well. I started to make short videos with my phone. It's like going to the gym, you, you're doing that every day starting from the small steps, uh, filming yourself in the room, then taking it uh, outside, maybe in the park. You can erase those videos after some time, uh, you can also rewatch them after a week or so and uh, try to analyze those to see what you could do better next time and what should you focus on and but yeah that helped me a lot Why do we keep Step number two, what you can do, it's you should ask your friends to help. You can ask for help from your partner, from your friend, so uh, my girlfriend Agla. So I will ask her, Agla, will you help me to try to overcome my fear in making videos in crowds? Will you? Yeah. As you can see, there are a lot of people around me and uh, I still feel kind of uncomfortable, but I have Agla with me, so she's filming me and I feel like we have a conversation, so I don't feel so uh, so crazy or so strange with talking just to the camera. Just be careful to choose a person whom you're asking to film you, because some of them can just make laugh at you and uh, that would be painful. Do you remember our first touch? When I look at you now, an adrenaline rush We're always looking for something more We're closer to the edge than never before I can't believe this body is fine I'm outside It doesn't make any sense This was not how I saw the end Tip number three would be that at the end of the day you have to be proud of what you're doing so if you are making vlog if you are filming yourself or whatever you're doing you have to believe in what you're doing you have to be proud of the project you're making if you're an actor and you are acting like a santa claus for the christmas party or something like that if you would be ashamed of what you're doing you probably would not be very good at that so uh, this thing this notion of to be proud of what you're doing probably helped me the most so I'm making YouTube videos, I'm making vlogging and uh, that's why I'm doing this is my job and I really like it so why should I be ashamed of what I'm doing? I, I nearly forgot one more thing I've just been I've just come back from Ukraine and it was fairly easy to vlog in there because most of the people around me they didn't understood a word I'm talking about which in, in this case in, in Dover for example everybody speaks English and uh, people might even laugh at you what if you are saying stupid things or acting crazily or whatever but yeah still just be proud of yourself